Greetings, weary travelers! Pull up a seat! Shirahime here with Let's Play Ragnarok Online Talonaro Server! Today, we are going to train a homunculus. Yee! <laughs> Fun fact, I have already tried to train six of them. They did not turn out. I just had to get rid of one that was level 75. Y yeah, if you want a good one, y you're gonna go through some pain. So, what you want to do first of all, if you want to make a homunculus, is you'll need the skills. You need bioethics, rest, call homunculus, and resurrect homunculus. You'll want those. Because we're going to need that. Because you have for calling them, you will need embryos, which I have, I believe, nine of left. I bought them from uh, Cray, who actually I think is down here brewing. <laughs> I just happened to come up here and I saw that he was, he was uh, brewing potions and stuff down here, so... I just thought that was kind of funny. Anyway, um, you can make embryos yourself by using uh, these shops and stuff here. I chose not to do that because people told me generally you don't actually save that much money. You're probably better off buying them from other people. So let's hope out of these nine that I don't have to buy more and that I'll get my vanilla. Because I'm going to train a vanil- a vanil- a vanil mirth? I don't know exactly how you say it. Something like- I just call them vanil for short. Like vanilla. <laughs> All right, let's try. Okay, that's that's definitely not what I want. <laughs> Hold still. View status. Delete. I'm sorry. No, I hate it when they cry. Yeah, you know, I you know I say I'm not deleting them. Actually, they're going to a nice homunculus orphanage somewhere, and somebody will adopt them and keep them as pets. They're just not meant to be uh, biochemist partners. That's all. Yeah, now I'm gonna go through this. Just for the video, I'm sure these are all going to fail because that's my kind of luck. Come on, Vanille, please. Come on. Stop making me make these cry. These poor babies all being sent to the orphanage. Are you serious? Come on. Don't do this to me, please. <laughs> that's what sucks is you're gonna get one of eight at random, so... Yeah, okay, give me everything but the one I want. Thanks. Get. Sorry, you're going to the orphanage too, buddy. Four more, come on. Okay, I guess uh, you have a brother or sister now who's coming with you. Goodbye. All right, it's gonna make me buy more. I can't believe this. <laughs> come on, Vanille. Come on, Vanille. I should have known this was gonna happen if I was gonna stream. Yep. I gotta buy more! Great! <laughs> well, let's make good good use of that shop jump command. Let's see if uh, Kray's still the cheapest seller. Oh no, he's not! These are actually slightly cheaper than his, so... Alright, let's try my lucky seven. Whoops. Oops, I didn't mean to buy one, I wanted to buy seven. Don't I have enough for that? I don't have enough zenny! Uh, okay. Wait, maybe I got some in the bank. I think I have a little zenny in the bank. Yay, I did put some zenny in the bank. Generally, I use it for new characters, but I did not realize how much money I've spent on this damn... Embryo fiasco. Okay. Please don't let me down. Oof! Oof! Alright, let's try again. Actually, let me clear this first. That's all the way south, jeez. Right, there's a nice clear area here. Let's try. Nope. Wrong vanilla! That's the other one that turns into that ugly bug thing and I don't want it. I'm sorry, not sorry. Oh my god, are you serious? This is the worst start to a video ever. <laughs> Why is my luck so bad? Are you kidding me? Come on! I'm gonna go broke! Don't do this to me! Oh my god, I might have to restart this dang video. No, a sheepy! 
I might want a sheepy at some point, but I don't want one right now. I'm sorry, sheepy! No! <laughs> oh my god, are you kidding me? Last try, come on. No! Why'd you give me three sheepies in a row? Oh my god, this sucks! Okay, I know the shop is like down here somewhere. I don't know exactly where though, I should have paid attention. It was down around these guys, right? Oh, screw it, I'll just... Oh god, this is gonna kill me. Oof! Oof! God, they're so expensive! Okay, I'm not gonna clear the shops this time, we're just gonna do it with the shops there. Maybe that'll bring me some strange kind of luck. That's definitely not luck. It never took me this long before to get one. Whoops, I don't want to feed it, no. It literally never took me this long, this long to get the one that I needed. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna go broke opening embryos, what the heck? And I say go broke because I spent 220 mil the other day. I finally got my dog! But yeah, 220 mil out the door. Sucked. Finally! Okay, we got one. Okay. Jeez. I did not want to spend any more money. <laughs> okay, we got our vanilla. So now we're gonna take him out and start to train him. Um, pretty simply, I just go south of Prontera first. But be careful because they're gonna like auto aggro anything around them, so if they auto aggro a creamy, they're probably gonna die. Make sure you warp away from those creamies in that case. Oops, and I also need to set my teleport so I can get around easily. I'm actually borrowing a friend's teleclip because I lent mine out today and didn't get it back yet. <laughs> Ooh, a feather. Those are for Betty, so make sure you pick those up sometimes. Now we want our little buddy here to get Int, Vit, and Agi, I believe. But Int is the most important. Okay, he got one Int to start. That's not too bad. Knew we got no Vit. But, uh, a uh, Int is definitely the most important for a Vanel Mirth or Vanille Mirth or whatever you call them. Definitely, definitely the most important. So if they start getting a lot of zeros in Int, it, you're gonna have a bad time. God, that was the worst start to a video ever. I'm so sorry. <laughs> People are gonna be laughing at my atrocious luck. If they don't already. Whoops, no, don't attack that creamy buddy. You can usually pull them away so they don't they don't go after if they're not too close to it. Depends on how you have your AI set up. Okay, good, you got a level. What did you get? Is that his level? Where's his... Shouldn't it be showing his level? Did it really go that fast? It's not showing his second level, what the heck? It should be. It should have shown his level, why didn't it? I'm confused. It's supposed to show their level stats down here, but it didn't show it for some reason. I, I need to know what he got. What did he get? Why didn't it show? <laughs> I'm so confused. I heard the level up sound. Oh yeah, I bring him down here after a couple of levels because uh, you can send him after baby desert wolves and he'll get a few levels on those. Okay, there we go. One int, okay. One and one is better than zeros. If he gets a lot of int zeros in a row, that's usually a sign. <laughs> of course, uh, the last one that I had, I named Miracle because he did so well. Up until about level 50. <laughs> and I mean, like, really well. He had excellent int. He had excellent, uh, vitality. And I was, I was so excited for him. 
so excited that I called him my miracle, and uh, it just didn't work out. Oh boy, there's a zero int. Great. Now don't immediately like delete when you get one zero int, because it's at random, you're going to get bad sets sometimes. But when you start to get a whole bunch in a row, that's a problem. See, he did get some other good stats there. He got two in Vit and two in Agi, which is pretty good. Well, he's sure not getting much SP, that's for sure. But yeah, this is where I take him second after Prontera Fields for a couple of levels. Because he gets pretty good experience off the baby desert wolves for a while. Granted, this is just what I found works for me with Vanille. I'm not sure if it's the same for leveling the other ones, but I imagine at the start you do start with easy things like this. Because you don't want them to struggle too much. Although I heard on this server, if the if the homunculus dies, they don't lose any uh, intimacy, which is really cool. Okay, he got one int that time. That's not too bad. And there are some things like you can look up online. Like there are things that tell you how much magic attack a vanilla Murs should have at a certain level. Like I believe at level um, at level thirty, he should have. What is it? It's either 200 or 300 magic attack. I think it's 200 at level 30. Something like that. But, um, yeah, you can look that stuff up online pretty easily. And, um, Sachi on this server has a, uh, a forum post with stat calculators for your homunculus so you can see how their growth is going and how they're doing in general. Sadly, that's why Miracle had to go, because his excellent stats actually, in 20 levels, dropped all the way to average and below average. Which was, which is heart-wrenching. He, I got him to level 75, I put so much work into him. <laughs> I'm sad. I just want a good one, you guys. One that I can call my partner. The rest, they'll find good homes. It's all good. Another one int. He's not getting any two ints, and that bugs me, but... It's just the start yet. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna decide this early. Go get him, buddy. But yeah, be a little careful on this map too if you bring them here, because uh, if they attack the uh, the ants, the different colored ants, the De Niro, the Pierre, and the Andre, like that one down there, you don't want him to attack that, he's probably gonna die, but he's gonna try to go for it, because he doesn't realize how small and weak he is, unfortunately. <laughs> but yeah, I thought doing uh, videos on homunculus might be fun, because I know a lot of people like to train them and make them, but some people don't necessarily know how or where to start, so I thought I'd walk you through a little bit of what I learned. And I learned from people like um, Sachi and Lonnie and some other people helped me out. So, uh, I'm just passing that info back on to you. No, don't attack the Andre! Don't, don't do it! Don't do it! I told you not to do it. I wanted him to go after the dog, but I need him to... Come on, de-aggro that thing. I think he should be far enough away now. Okay, good. Get the puppy. I'm not judging this vanilla too early, but uh, he's doing okay. I'm not going to say he's doing great, because he's getting a lot of ones. And I believe he already had a zero so far, too. And one level that I couldn't see for some weird reason. That was weird. But yeah, actually, next from here, we're just gonna go, um... Okay, I'm, uh, no, 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 no! Bad! Bad. Come on. Come on, stop aggroing things you shouldn't. Get away from him, come on. Come on! Oh my god. Come on, stop trying to fight him! Get out of there! Jeez. 
Oh yeah, and for feeding and intimacy, like you see right now he's in the red. If he's below 25, that's exactly when you want to feed him, between 11 and 24. Or 11 and 25, rather. Because they will get a full point of intimacy if you feed them at that point. You get 0.75 if you feed them between 25 and 75, I believe. And then you get even less if you feed overfeed them, like past 75. And I think you only get a little bit if you like starve them down to like nothing, so be careful with that. The point that you really want to feed them at for max intimacy is between 11 and 25. I generally do when I see the bar go red at 24. That's usually the point that I say, okay, it's time to feed him. My last one was doing pretty good on intimacy too. <laughs> oh, I'm just so sad. He was not my miracle after all. I know some people are gonna be like, wow, you were so mean. Why did you get rid of him? I, I want a partner, you know? I want somebody I can count on to be by my side with me and protect me and go to great maps together where we can level together. That kind of thing. I'm just gonna get a couple of these things on the way here. They're not too, uh, they won't cause any problems for him. He's fine with savage babies. Or savage babes. I thought they were called savage babies, but now I see savage babe. I guess it depends on the the KRO client. Well, he might get a level on the way there, but yeah, we're going to Rockers next. Hopefully. I don't know how his Dex is doing, but uh... That's gonna be the problem when I have him go after Creamies, I think. Whoop! He got a 2 in int! I'm happy for that! 0 in Vit, not so great, but... Hey, you got 2 in Agi too, nice. And it's nice for ha for him to have a bit of dex as well, so... Happy with that. The one stat you don't want is luck. I don't know why they put it on there, it's apparently useless to like... All the homunculuses. Luck doesn't really matter to any of them. I don't know why it's there, except to annoy you. <laughs> Boy, definitely doesn't want to give him SP though. He's getting like nothing. I, it seems like every time I have one, they don't get good SP. Which I guess doesn't really matter. That's not something that matters very much. Because most of the time, he's just going to use his SP until he can't use it. Okay, we're going to hit a couple of things here, and then I'm probably going to take him to a uh, pouring world. <laughs> No, Pouring World is not an actual place, it's just that one map that has a lot of pourings on it where Angeling and Deviling spawn and Ghost Ring. But yeah, he'll hit a lot of Popo Rings and Marins there and he'll get good experience off of those. So we're gonna bring him there next. But that might be for next video, like I'll probably get there and start a new video. For now we'll just see if we can get another level or two for him here. So he can handle rockers and uh, popo rings pretty easily at this level. He's not really struggling, he's not dying. He's doing alright. And they do get skills, not very many, but they do get some skills. Oh god, he got an int zero, I was afraid of that. Ugh. Okay. Oh yeah, he can get some- he has some Caprice now, which is good. This means he's gonna cast a random bolt on an enemy. That's the Vanilla special thing, they use magic. Attack magic, rather. There are other ones that use magic, I think, but more supportive magic to uh, help you. Like, the lift can help you escape <laughs> by boosting your Agi or something, so... Come on, buddy. I don't want to give up on you this quickly. But yeah, usually if they're doing, like, terribly by, like, level, say, 15 or 20, then you're probably going to want to start over. You haven't lost too much, but then you have to go through the whole embryo thing again and probably spend money, and that's not fun. <laughs> Let's see if we can get him one more level, huh? Another level or two? Here, we'll pop around and look for some popo rings. Popo, where you go, go. Got to find the popo. 
Oh, random merchant. <laughs> eh, there's a couple of rockers here. We'll let him go after these. I have him set right now so he doesn't stray too far from me when I have him to, like, he he'll go around me and protect me. But he'll go in, like, this, uh, a square about this size that I'm making on the screen right now. That's about the perimeter that he'll do, but if there's something like out here, he's gonna try to go after it anyways because he's set to chase things. But when he's just patrolling, he'll go around me in that, in that path. You can set them to standby, like if you want them to recover their HP, SP, etc., etc., and not run around. You can set them to standby. But see, right now he's gonna start doing the. Uh, Oh, no, I guess that one's close enough that he can get it. I didn't think it was, but... Oh, he's going for it. Oh, you got a level. Okay, int 2. Not bad. He's making up for- Whoa, he got a lot of good things that level. He got Agi, Vit, and Int with 2, which I'm happy about. I hope seven's gonna be the one. Seven's my lucky number, and me and Luck really don't mix, but I'm hoping. I'm dreaming, I'm hoping. Yeah, I don't care about Javelin. I have bonus bundle on, so I was uh, leveling Miracle and Toy Factory earlier. But Miracle's gone now. But we'll eventually get this guy into Toy Factory, hopefully, if he doesn't, you know, end up. <laughs> end up terrible. <laughs> uh, I I'm just hoping this is gonna be the one, especially if I'm doing videos on him and everything. Just really hope things are gonna work out this time. But yeah, I'm over the 20 minute mark, so I should probably get, uh... Well, there's a popo ring, I'm gonna take that. And then we're gonna... He's gonna go for probably the closest one to you, generally. Or not. Because I feel like the popo was definitely closer, I don't know what you're doing, buddy. Come on, there's a popo, like, right up here, get him. Usually he goes for what's closest to me. Okay, that time he did. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay, well, I'll let him kill this one. Alright, then I'll just work my way on warping out of here. But for now, I want you guys to have safe travels, my friends. And I, and my little Vanillmirth here, will see you next time.